As stated by the Royal Institution of Chartered Surveyors, cash flow is the lifeblood of the construction industry and relates to the incoming or outgoing of money to or from a company over a given period. Within construction contracts, a cash flow forecast is very often used as a tool within organisations through all levels of the supply chain and indeed by the client to try and help inform and predict what their monetary commitments under a contract will be. Before we look at what cash flow forecasts are and why they can be useful to construction professionals such as quantity surveyors and project managers, please subscribe to our channel if you're enjoying our videos as we upload new content every single week. Cash flow on a project is calculated by subcontracting cash outflows from cash inflows over a particular period, be that weekly, monthly, yearly or over the course of a project. You can think of cash inflows as sources of cash and cash outflows as uses of cash or expenses. When a construction company produces the cash flow forecast, it allows them to calculate their net cash position at that point in time, but vitally helps them to predict what their net cash position will be in the future or over the period of a project, for example. Now, this is very important in the construction industry as there are generally a lot of moving parts to think about. So after predicting your cash inflows, such as payments of applications and investments, and cash outflows, such as subcontractors, suppliers, staff, vehicles and overheads each month, or whatever the period may be, and subtracting one from the other. You could be left with a cash flow forecast that looks something like this. As you can see, the cash flow enters a negative position in January and April. This is caused by more cash needing to be paid out than is predicted to be paid in. Once you have a cash flow forecast in place, you have essentially mapped out your net cash position over a given period. And in doing so, it enables you to come up with a plan to improve your cash flow before it becomes reality and puts your organisation into trouble by potentially not being able to pay its debts. Because if a company cannot pay its debts, it may become insolvent. It can be useful to update the cash flow based on the actual progress and cash inflows and outflows as they occur. The actuals can be plotted on the same graph, like this, to present actual progress versus planned and any variation between the cash flow forecast in blue and actual cash flow in orange. This sometimes helps with future analysis and lessons learned on future projects. So how can you improve cash flow? Well, let's start with the obvious producing effective and accurate cash flow forecasts. Process change orders quickly and efficiently. Agreeing additional works and payment is essential to keeping your cash flow positive. The longer disputes over additional work carry on for, the more likely it is to affect the cash flow. Send out invoices as soon as possible. The sooner a client receives an invoice, the sooner payment is likely to be made. Shop for the best prices. Due to the nature of construction projects, Procuring different materials, generally in large quantities, is a huge cost. Being smart with purchases can greatly help keep a handle on cash outflows. Ensure your project manager understands and manages cash flow on a project effectively. Avoid over and under billing. Try to make your applications and invoices accurate to the works you have actually carried out. Decrease your payment terms, but increase the payment terms of your cash outflows such as subcontractors, wherever possible. To learn more about how managing cash flow can help on a particular construction project, check out our video on project cash flows. We've popped the link in the description below. Matrone, a commercial hub to your business.